life, life before Jesus first. I was born in Brazil. Um, I was born to my mother who raised me. My mom really wasn't able to take care of me. She, she had my sister she couldn't afford to take care of. We lived in a house that had nothing, no wa running water, no food, and no electricity. My grandmother was really the one who was raising me. She was 28. My grandmother had to do what was best for her, which was to essentially put me in an orphanage. What they couldn't give me, they, they would hope that somebody else could give to me. Well, one day I got word that two people from Florida were interested in me and they said that they would take the opportunity to come down and so they did. I found these parents here and they ended up loving on me more more than I, can, I could ever imagine and I was I was brought up Catholic a little bit you know and it was it was good but it wasn't really teaching me God you know, it wasn't really teaching me Jesus and wasn't really teaching me how I'm supposed to really walk in this world. Um, so I followed other people. I was the one man, the one person that you would, you would want to go out with and have fun. And my type of fun involved a lot of money at that time and it involved a lot of running around at night and getting in trouble. I was self-medicating bad. And I didn't I, I was led to dark paths. So like the test, the the blood, the tears, the heartache, I mean the isolation, the depression, the not having anybody around and it made me realize that I was trapped at that point. So I asked God for, truly, God, I asked God for help. Ask God to light up my world where I was because I was so deep in this darkness that there was no way out but to like go through it. When I finally seen Christ, it was more of not just an eye opener, but more of a spiritual opener. So like to actually wake up now and, and look at what I could be is way better to look back where I was and, and where I was wasn't where I needed to be now. Um, knowing what God did for us and what Jesus has done for us and the things that he's been through, that, that this will be the best thing that's gonna happen to me. Coming into church experience was just like, whoa. I walked in to a room full of people and it was just so perfect that there was one room left, you know, one spot left. I was that spot, <laughs> you know. Um, from there on end, CE is the place to be, you know. This is my home, being a part of kid experience, being a part of this church, knowing you guys has been like life changing, you know? I feel like every time I come in, I'm not just being welcomed home, but like I'm being welcomed to like a family that is gonna forever love on me. Life is good. <laughs>